I was going to highlight maybe three milestones that stand out for me. One was um, getting the opportunity to work abroad, which I did uh, for a number of years in both the UK and US. It was a very, very exciting time, but also quite fulfilling learning how to see how other markets work. Secondly, was becoming a partner in, in Arthur Cox. I joined in 2016, and that was, you know, was a big vote of confidence in my now partners. And then lastly, I suppose, is uh, becoming head of the corporate at M&A group here. That's a big department in the firm, and to be elected by your peers is, is a real honor uh, and privilege. So the, the, you know, the three of those would be real highlights. So I started in 1998, and I remember there were, we didn't have any computers, uh, there was no email, um, so the biggest change probably in whatever, 25 years is, is technological, I think. Uh, where before, you know, you had a big fax room, communication was just slower, um, you had probably longer to respond to things. Uh, with the advent of, this was modern and mobile communication has huge advantages because it gives us flexibility in our lives and you know, the ability to work from home, work from wherever you may be. But it's also imposed us with much faster response times, much faster requirements in terms of turning documents, uh, delivering client service. So I think probably then, as we look forward to the next number of years, as you see AI begin to impact our industry, I think tech technology is going to be the biggest, biggest change. So mentorship, massive part of my career, um, and I think probably anyone's in his career. So anyone who's starting out, or even in the middle of the career, middle of the career, I'd, I'd you know I'd actively seek mentors, be it formal or informal. But from certainly from my perspective, yeah, I, I had the opportunity to work with as a, as a young lawyer with very closely with a partner who became a, a mentor who I'm still very close to, friendly with. And then even then, you know, as you move on in your career, that doesn't go away. So even though you're a partner, you're running a department, I still receive mentorship from both my partners and, and indeed other junior, more junior members of the team. It, it, it goes both ways. So I think it's a critical part of anyone's career. Um, you don't operate in a vacuum, it's a people business. So um, mentorship has been very important to me and frankly wouldn't have gotten to where I am without it. I, I don't think I change an awful lot. Um, you know, I've had a very fulfilling or satisfying career to date. I think what I'd say though is um, a couple of things. One, on the work side of it, really build your network, cultivate your network, continue to stay in touch with people, even if you know a transaction has finished or you got on with somebody. You know, it, it's part of. What makes work interesting is building out your, your relationships. So I, I, I would certainly emphasize that. And the other thing I think I'd say is, you know, it's a long career. Do, do take time to enjoy the moments, be it with family, your holidays, and, you know, take the moment to actually maybe put the head up and smell the roses a little bit. Because uh, we all move at a very fast pace and um, sometimes it's good to just to, just to take stock and get, and get your your downtown.